Also remind me of the W212E class back then. emblem here which looks so nice and considering the fact that we are at the home of driving performance right now this is really cool hello guys and welcome back here again on mr ben's youtube channel today featuring this the all-new facelift e63s amg as you can already see, we are here at the AMG headquarters here in Falterbach with this beautiful E63S Zedam model. In this video, I will be doing a walk around showing you all the exterior features and what came new with the new E-Class. Afterwards, we will jump inside. I'm going to show you the interior features. And last but not least, we're going to rev it. I'm going to show you a sound check of that car and a quick resume. So before we start, I'm going to talk about this car in specific. Here we have the E63S, the facelifted model. This is not a new E-Class, this is just a facelift. So this car is equipped with a V8 bi-turbo AMG engine, which produces 612 brake horsepower. And as you can see, it is um, painted in high-tech silver metallic exterior paint. This paint has a new paint which uh, there have been several paints coming with the latest E-Class, such as graphite gray, etc. Uh, but let's start with the walk around, starting with the front here of the new E-Class facelift, the 63 front. As you can see, it's very brutal and aggressive. Very nice front, updated headlights, new grille, new front, etc. So let's start here with the updated headlight, as you can see, we have one center LED stripe here and two double LED modems, which look beautiful on the new E-Class here. Uh, these came with a new facelift. As you know, back then we had a double LED stripe, but now we have one center LED eyebrow and two eyes. So for the future, you can already think the new S-Class will come with a center eyebrow and maybe three eyes and the c-class will come with one center eyebrow and one eye so let's continue here as you can see here we have the latest mercedes-benz front emblem in full black beautiful front bonnet here with these power domes really looking muscular really love that here the new mercedes amg front grille 12 vertical stripes here really looking nice as you know the new shape of the grille design here now the a shaped back then it was the v shaped and now a shaped front grille here 12 vertical amg performance front grille here also known as the panamericana then we have the mercedes 3d star emblem here as you can see it's huge behind that we have assistant packages such as the destroying and else hiding we have the front camera which looks kind of weird because it's located on the left side it's like destroying the whole symmetry of the e63 front to be honest but never mind here we have the amg emblem on the grill as always really looking nice so let's continue here with the front bumper as you see we have the night package installed therefore these parts are fully chromed uh, if we didn't have the night package these would be chrome you can see here the jet wing design front really looking nice here with the black exterior paint uh, beautiful intakes here with uh, the air intakes here with the filter as you can see this is real there's no plastic covers or else really looking nice here we have an airflow then we have the front splitter here finished in carbon fiber and on the right side, again, the front intake here with the filters, exterior paint, black piano here since we have the night package. So that's it basically for the front. How do you guys like this updated E63 front? Just comment down below, really curious how you think about that. So let's continue with the side of this E63. As you can see here, Zidane model, the four door, beautiful 
as you already noticed, we have a new front, also known as the shark front end, which is abruptly ending, going here vertical. It's really nice. Love that new updated front. Here we have the side silhouette of the E63. The beautiful sides here. It's wider than a normal E-Class since there's a 63. With a 53, you don't have a wider body, but uh, there has been many changes on that. So let's continue here with the side and the beautiful rims. Here we have the beautiful AMG multi-spoke wheels finished in black. Really love this. AMG engraved here with the Mercedes star center lock. Then we have the AMG carbon ceramic brakes here in gold, which I really love. Give this car a more exclusive touch and elegant. Looks very nice. Love that. Um, definitely fitting great on that. 20 inch wheels here. Then here we have the V8 by Turbo badge for Matic Plus with this beautiful additional part here finished in black also because we have the night package. If we didn't have the night package, this would be chrome. Continuing here with the sides, here we have the side mirror finished in carbon fiber. We have the carbon fiber exterior package. Therefore, we have the carbon fiber front skirt, the side mirrors, and also the rear. There is some more carbon fiber for you. As you can see, night package here. Four blacked out frames, rear windows tinted, really looking nice. Door handles are finished in chrome. Since we have the keyless go package, it's always chrome, even if you have the night package. Then we have the rear wheels here, MG multi spoke here, beautiful, really looking fire here. Mercedes star center lock here. And we have the AMG engraved there, the carbon ceramic brakes. Also golden finish, 20 inch here. So let's continue and finish it off with the rear. Beautiful E63S rear here. How do you guys like it? What's your, what's your first thoughts about this E63 here? So let's start here with the tail lights. New updated tail lights. Now two parts here running from here also to the trunk part. Beautiful, it's like OLED crocodile kind of rear tail lights, which I really love. Also remind me of the W212 E-Class back then. Um, really love these, um, great update here. Then we have the AMG emblem here in chrome, the chrome part here, which I quite don't understand. Um, since we have the night package, this is still chrome. With the Mercedes Star also in chrome, the rear spoiler here finished in carbon fiber, which comes with the carbon fiber exterior package. And we have the rear diffuser here. Wait, let me just show you the direct view of the beautiful rear here. The new updated exhaust tips here from AMG for the E63. Really looking nice. These are finished in black since we have the night package. Then we have here a few carbon parts running through the diffuser, which really look nice. Beautiful AMG engraved inside. And we have the graves here, which really look nice since we have the performance exhaust also mounted on this one. I really love these here, the carbon part running through the whole diffuser. We have the beautiful new updated diffuser also finished in black. On the right side here looking fire really love that so how do you guys like the rear of this updated e63s just comment down below can't wait to read your comments so before i continue with the interior of this e63s i'm going to show you the key of this beautiful car as you know latest mercedes amg key there has been no changes or at all um, beautiful finished in brushed silver here AMG engraved in black, black piano buttons here, lock, unlock, and the trunk. It's with the Mercedes star. Really love this design key. Then, as you know, beautiful Falterbach AMG rear emblem here, which looks so nice. And also, considering the fact that we are at the home of driving performance right now, this is really cool. So, let's uh, jump inside the E63 and let me show you the interior of this. Thank you. 
as you can already see we have the latest mercedes amg steering wheel which i've presented you a few weeks ago but uh, before we show you this interior i'm going to show you the door side panel here as you can see beautiful really love this full leather trim here with the yellow stitching which we will find all over the interior as well then we have the carbon fiber trim here the Bormester sound speaker which look very nice and elegant the uh, memory seat settings which you can adjust as you want to be etc um, heating cooling etc and we have the buttons over there beautiful yellow stitching running through also with the black stitching here and uh, now it's time to get inside so let's jump inside but before we do that here we have the amg running board here which is illuminated basically I'm just turning on in the night you can see it more clearly but now it's time to get inside the E63S. So here we are now inside the new AMG E63. So here we are now inside the beautiful E63 AMG, as you've already seen the beautiful animation of this car. We have the AMG floor mats here, which is which are just essential. I don't know where to start basically there are so many changes uh, i've already done a full review on the new amg steering wheel uh, all the details full function etc so if you are interested in the new amg steering wheel just check out my video of that and let's start with the steering wheel uh, here we have the beautiful amg steering wheel the latest one flat bottom here uh, leather trim alcantara also known as dynamica um, beautiful yellow stitching here all over the steering wheel as well then we have the mercedes amg specific and new updated steering wheel buttons as you know back then uh, the right one was rounded and the left one was kind of oval uh, and uh, wasn't fitting to the overall uh, proportions of the steering wheel but now they've been updated here also the new steering wheel frame here with the amg engrave which is kind of small which I'm uh, mm, not keen about. Then we have the doppeldecker here. Beautiful capacitive um, uh, touch pads here, which work really nice and are way easier to use than the uh, touch pads back then, just by swiping and touching and tapping also. We have uh, buttons here still. Uh, then we have the updated shift pedals here, up and down. They are kind of C-shaped, which I'm going to show you from over here, as you can see. It's a C-shaped here. Then uh, we have a full carbon fiber trim on the center console and the dash. Really looking nice. Um, beautiful. As you can already see, we have a full leather trim here with the yellow stitching running through the whole interior, which is just optional for the E63 models. For the E53 models, uh, there's an option to go with the red stitching, but the yellow full stitched interior is just for the E63 only. So just uh, for you all to know, we have the stitching all over the interior, which looks so nice. Um, also Mercedes AMG sport seats here. Really love these. We have yellow trim here. Then we also have a yellow leather running through the whole seat here. Black stitching, black leather. Then we have the Dynamica, the dark gray leather here, which is perforated the AMG emblem here and the AMG of Falterbach emblem over there which looks so nice like super super nice really love this just to show a walk through the interior also we have the panorama roof here which is just essential 3d speakers Bormester here um, let me show you these it's super cool just let me start the ignition then whenever I start oh so whenever i start uh turning up the volume just look at this and if i lower it again look at this oh bullmaster this is the best thing you can go for great sound by the way um that's not nothing new we had it with the uh, preface of s-class already but it always catches me so um as you see here we have the mercedes amg steering wheel buttons which on the right side you can turn new design also here this is race looks super nice 
Sport Plus, Sport, Comfort, uh, Individual and Slippery. Looks super nice. Just look at this. New updated designs on that one also. And on the right side, you can't turn it just by pressing and tapping here, exhaust on, off, etc. So that's it basically from the interior, how you guys like it. I'm uh, really curious about your opinion. Just comment down below. So now it's time for the ultimate sound check. Let me just start up here the car afterwards. I'm going to start it up from the outside. So let's go. Nice. So now we will be going outside. We will be starting with the sound check of this E63. You've all been waiting for a great and new updated sound. So let's do this. So it's now time for the ultimate sound check of the E63S. We'll be demonstrating you the sound differences of Comfort, Sport and Sport Plus. So let's go. So this was Comfort. Now let's go with Sports. Let's finish it all off with Sports Plus. Wow. Wow. Just impressive. Wow. Crazy sound. It's similar, kind of similar to the GT63S now, but sounding really nice. I can't wait to finally drive one of these and also show you my driving experiences especially with the sound in the interior. So now let's finish it all off with a resume. So that's it basically for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed watching. Uh, as a resume, I can say I really love the new facelifted E63, especially the new front design, the new headlights here, the shark and especially uh, how do you guys like it? How do you guys like the sound of this E63? Comment down below. Already looking forward to read and also to all your comments. Looking forward to see you again and wish you all a great day. Goodbye.